What's up guys? Right now I'm brewing an oolong from Taiwan. Now this is definitely one of the most famous oolongs from Taiwan. It's called a Dongding. And right now you can look at the dry leaf here. So the dry leaf is the bald style oolong. And let's see, alright, so my opinion with these Taiwan oolongs is you can see the stem attached to the leaf. Most of the Chinese oolongs, some people disagree with me on this, but I mean, with like Tiguan Yin, and in my experience, a lot of times you can't see the stem attached, it's just the leaf. With these Taiwan oolongs, you can see the leaf. Alright, so let's give this a taste. Now this liquor, the leaf is dark, and then even when you brew it, it's dark, and it smells roasted, it's got like a medium kind of roast to it. And the liquor is actually kind of surprisingly golden and light in color. Pour that out, and now let's take a look at the let's take a look at the wet leaf. Now here's where you really see that the stem is oftentimes attached to the leaf with these Taiwan-style oolongs. So see that leaf there, and you can compare that. So obviously, like we know with bald-style oolongs, it opens up a lot when you infuse it and it gets lighter in color. You can see we used a lot of leaf here. These got, these, these got really big. Very good aroma on that. Alright, let's taste it. <laughs> 